myself that could happen you know you never know and if that does happen I mean Master Zeno has backups if you can't get Benitas and Sora fused together he could always get Replica Riku you know let's say Replica Riku is brought back or if Vexen had a backup version of Replica Riku, a backup data stored in Replica Riku that Master Xehanort and the Organization 13 can use, that might work to where Replica Riku becomes Master Xehanort's vessel. I know this shit sounds confusing as shit, but it's not. It's just badass. But if that happens... It'll all be worth it. It'll be crazy, man. And then if that happens, Replica Riku could become the 13th vessel of Master Xehanort. Okay. Even if Vanitas turns his back on Master Xehanort because he has Sora and feels like he's stronger now with the X-Blade, you never know, that could happen. Fucking seeing Replica Riku fight with um, a few Sora and Vanitas, that'll be pretty epic. But yeah, that could happen. But I've also had a theory, another theory. I feel like Vexen, and this will really be for another video, but I'm going to go ahead and talk about it a little bit in this video. I'm thinking that maybe they have a ba Vexen had a backup data, a backup. Basically, I feel like Vexen has data of Sora stored somewhere, right? So what if Master Xehanort retrieves this data of Sora and creates a replica Sora the same way Vexen created a replica Riku and now we could have two antagonists. We could have a replica Sora and a replica Riku potentially clashing with each other also forging the X-Blade and then a fuse replica Riku with replica Sora if Tetsuo Norma does that could ultimately become the 13th vessel of Master Xehanort. That can happen as well. I mean, Master Xehanort has so many different routes to take. You know, Terra isn't his only route. He has so many routes. And that may happen. We never know. And if it does, I think that'll be dope. Two antagonists that are basically different versions of Sora and Riku and they it's like he gets the best worlds of both it's like Master Xehanort would get the best of both worlds it's like Master Xehanort would get the best of both worlds because originally Master Xehanort had his eyes set on Riku young Xehanort said that remember in Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance and we also remember in Kingdom Hearts 1 when Xehanort's Heartless and the Seeker of Darkness fused with Riku, they wanted to make Riku the vessel, and Riku was pretty damn close to becoming that vessel if it wasn't for Sora saving him. So it'd only be right if maybe Sora became a vessel of Vanitas, or even a replica Sora, whatever. And let's say replica Riku, or even the original Riku tried to save. Tried to save um, his friend Sora. Even if it is just a data version, it's still Sora. But like I said, you know, there's endless possibilities. Y'all let me know down in the comment section down below what y'all think. Don't forget to like and subscribe. But yeah, I know this video is all over the place, but I mean, I feel like Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to be all over the place, so why not? You know, if they can do it, I can do it. <laughs> you dig? But yeah. I just want to see some straight up raw fucking action. We need to see this shit. And that could happen. 
You know, we never know. And that's just crazy to think. Think about all these damn characters with the X-Blade. Fucking Replica Riku fused with Replica Sora. Having an X-Blade. Sora and Vanitas fused together. Having an X-Blade. Roxas and Vin fused together. Having an X-Blade. These characters fighting each other in the Keyblade Wars with all these X-Blades. It's just so much. It's just like... It's going to be epic. It's definitely going to be violent. It's going to be dark. Lives are going to be taken. Darkness is going to prevail. So maybe Sora and Benitas, if they're fused together, will take out Ben and Roxas being fused together. You know, that's pretty dark. You never know. That way, Benitas would not need... Ben anymore. Sora wouldn't need Roxas anymore because he'd have Benitas and Dark Side, but he would be possessed, which sucks. But it would be a dope ass fight. Seeing Sora do all of these evil and moral acts, I just think it'll be epic. But man, I just hope where my mind is right now, I'm hoping. Tetsuo Norma makes Kingdom Hearts 3 like this, just a big ass mind fuck. Like just damn, what what just happened? Like that's what I want. What the hell just happened? The Guardians of Light were winning, but now the fucking Seekers of Darkness seem to be prevailing. Like what's going on? Benitas and Sora is just wrecking shit. Just like savages, man. Who knows? Light and darkness clashing together. The way it should be. And then Riku fighting fucking Master Xehanort. I mean, who knows? Endless possibilities, man. It's worth it. And if it happens, so be it. But yeah, this, this has just been on my mind. It's been on my mind. I had to speak about it. I had to talk about it. I love talking about Kingdom Hearts. I really want to interact with y'all. Anyone that's watching this video, I'd like it if you commented, liked, and subscribed. That would be great because I will interact with every one of you. I swear to God. Like, no bullshit. And I just, I don't know what Master Zeno is going to do, who's going to be the 13th vessel. All I have is dope ass theories, but man. I just don't know. But I mean... Looking forward to it. Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Young Dan, and I'm back with another Kingdom Hearts 3 discussion. Today, we will be talking about Benitas possibly fusing with Sora and Roxas possibly fusing with Vin. If this happens, I think it'll be epic as fuck. Some real shit. And just imagine it. Sora fused with Benitas forging the X-Blade. 
rocks is fused with Ben forging the X blade. It's just amazing seeing two characters fighting with the X blade, duking it out. Who will prevail? The Guardians of Light or the Darkness? Or the Seeker of Darkness, Sora and Benita's Fuse? Or the Guardian of Light, Roxas and Vin Fuse? You know, it's just kind of hard to tell. It's all up in the air, it's all speculation, but who knows? But like Benita said, there's no escape. There really is no escape. So. It's going to be a dark series, and I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to this dark Kingdom Hearts 3 that will be coming. And it's just like I said, it leads me to think, you know, if... Roxas and Ven fuse and Sora and Benita's fuse and then the merged Roxas and Ven fights the merged Sora and Benita's what if the two merged beings end up fusing with each other like what if all four characters end up fusing with each other because they're really the same person and since they're the same person Sora and Roxas, Vin and Venetus, and they're just connected to different people, substituting what they originally used to be. I think all four of them will fuse. I think Sora, Venetus, Vin, and Roxas will all just end up fusing from the class that they will have. And when that happens, we'll see them fighting each other in each other's hearts like this. And it'll be dope as hell, it'll be epic. I mean, I'm looking forward to it, it could happen. Never know. And if that happens, in the outside world, all Riku, Roxas, Kairi, Lee, or Re not Re not Roxas, all Riku, Mickey, Lee, Kairi, Aqua, and potentially young Ericus and Master Ericus will see a fused being of four different people with two X blades in his hand, basically attacking the Seekers of Darkness and the Guardians of Light. Because we gotta remember, Vanitas is in control of Sora, so he's gonna be for the Seekers of Darkness. Okay, Vin and Roxas are fused together if they do this, so they're going to be fighting for the Guardians of Light. So if this happens, it'll just be a serious, confusing mindfuck, and this being fused with all different four characters, showing us a being we've never seen before, with two different lights and two different darknesses, all merged into one, we'll see this fused being of four different characters fighting the the 13 Seekers of Darkness and the 7 Guardians of Light. And that'll be crazy. This being will be like going at everybody with no restraint. Because half of this being wants to fight with the Seekers of Darkness and the other half of the being wants to fight with the Guardians of Light. So it just creates complete chaos. Like a war should be. Complete chaos. That's how I feel about it. But yeah. I mean, it'll just be exciting. It'll be dope. And I'm just, yeah, and then seeing this being fight Terranoid, you know, what, what was the name of this, 
this character would be, since this character would be made up of Sora, Roxas, Ben, and Benitas, what would the name be like? That's just crazy. You have to call this man like four different names. It's crazy. Definitely the door to Kingdom Hearts would be open, but man, it's going to be open in such an unnatural way. That even it's 